Okay, my dear students, today I would like to solve this problem, which was asked in J mains 2020. Uh, let us take a smart and simple shortcut approach to solve this problem here. So you can see the question here, it is given now. So this is a pulley, pulley with mass. It is a pulley with mass. It is not like an ordinary pulley where you can apply the acceleration is equal to m1 minus m2 by m1 plus m2 into g. That formula doesn't work out here. So a simple, a smart change in the basic formula will work out here. Let us see what is going to happen here. So he is asking us to find out what is an angular speed, isn't it? So he is asking us to find out what is an angular speed. Okay. So how can you find out an angular speed? You have to find out an angular speed. So first of all, you all know acceleration. What is the formula for acceleration? What is the formula for acceleration? You know the general formula for acceleration in the case of massless pulley, the same formula, a slight dramatic changes we have to do. What is that? Now, the thing is, M2 is there and M1 is greater is telling. So it is coming downwards and M2 is moving upwards. So slight small smart changes is, you know that it is written as M1 minus M2 by M1 plus M2 into G we write if it is a massless pulley but here a small change is we have to add one more mass that is mass of the pulley so what is the mass of the pulley here you all know i is equal to mr square but you have right here m is equal to i by r square that's it so here you have to add i divided by r square capital r he has given the radius as capital r here so that's a small change you have to do. You have to add i by r square. That's it. Then what are you going to get? Let us see. Okay. So uh, acceleration is there. You have to find out angular speed. And it is said that the system is released from rest. Okay. It has traveled a certain distance. So what is the formula for velocity if it has tra traveled a certain distance? You know velocity v square minus 0 square is equal to 2gh. This is the basic formula okay so initial velocity of the pulleys i mean system is a zero that is the blocks is zero we just write v is equal to square root of 2g h but here as it is an acceleration we write 2a h here okay because it is given in the problem 2a h then what are you going to write in the base of acceleration you write a as an acceleration so your new pro new solution will become square root of and this will write now m1 minus m2 divided by m1 plus m2 and this r will come here we can write this as r square and plus i will be there so r square is an lcm it is a denominator that's why uh, we, we can write this r here now out of the square okay so r will come outside the square here right here you are going to write the r now but what is angular speed you all know that v is equal to r omega so omega is equal to v by r that's it v by r so if you substitute the value of v here that is r into square root of 2 into m1 minus m2 okay and here acceleration we have substituted here square root of uh, 2a h also we have tried isn't it you have to add h also isn't it you have to add a h and you have to write this g also here because acceleration there was g and this is total formula for acceleration this is h here we have written that is now what you have to do is uh, omega is equal to v by r okay so what is m1 uh, m1 minus m2 uh, and gh divided by m1 plus m2 into r square plus h whole divided by r so with this these two gets cancelled and this is going to be the left out part so this is going to be the left out part you can just see which is going to tally with that okay so m1 minus m2 your correct answer is going to be i think uh, first option i think 